Occupy Wall Street protest. Protest on Wall Street. Occupy Wall Street. Uh, Occupy Wall Street. Occupy Wall Street. Occupy Wall Street. Occupy Wall Street movement. Occupy everywhere. Liberal protesters. He's anarchist. This is the liberal version of the Tea Party. Liberal groups and unions. The underemployed and the overeducated. People with absolutely no purpose or focus in life. Seriously? And Wall Street protester Danny Penzella. Danny, to you first. What are the protests about? What do you and, other, the, and the other protesters want? Well, I think that for the most part, uh, the protesters are looking for freedom and equality. And uh, they have a little bit of a different view on how to get there than the Tea Party does. But I think some of the, some of the if you cut through the rhetoric, some of the goals are, are really the same. We started OccupyTheFed.net a few weeks ago. What we were trying to do was kind of uh, glean off the momentum that the Occupy Wall Street movement has and just kind of funnel that back into the right direction towards the Fed rather than the straw man of capitalism. Because we really don't even have true free market capitalism. No, you got six big mega banks that own the Fortune 100 and then some who are organizing the economy and everything into themselves and shutting down their competition and trying to get more people dependent on their fiat system so they control them. That's right, absolutely. And when you break that down for people, you'll see the light bulb go off in their head. Ladies and gentlemen, we do not live in a free market capitalist society. The Federal Reserve Bank is a private corporation that centrally plans our economy. This is not the free market. This is not even truly capitalism. It is fascism. When a private bank controls the issuance of currency in violation of the U.S. Constitution, we can't fire the banking CEOs. We can only fire Congress, which is why the which is why the Constitution requires that the money be printed by the Congress, so they would be accountable to the people. The economic crisis was an inside job, and the Federal Reserve is the inside man. We are being manipulated by a central bank. We are being lied to by a corrupt government, bought and paid for by big corporations. Hey Obama, what happened to the $500 billion you threw at Syndra? Where'd it go? Down the drain. Where'd you get it? The Federal Reserve printed it. Government budget is $3.6 trillion. Government only raises. and politics. Get us back to sound money. That's right. Audit the Fed. Go I want to know money. where all these Never trillions money. of dollars have went. I want to know how much gold we have in our reserves. Until you what fix this problem, until you fix this problem, nothing else matters because we will not turn around the financial crisis we have.
history right now and we need to choose and the tea party and everyone else needs to choose are you gonna are you gonna let your ego get in the way and say I'm not gonna work with a leftist or I'm not gonna work with a communist or I'm not gonna work with a tea party or are you gonna let your ego stand in the way of real change because we have the opportunity now to join forces this is an issue the Fed is an issue that both the left and the right can get behind are we gonna join forces and go against this criminal cartel or are we gonna allow them to to use ego to divide and conquer us and yet another revolution is gonna diminish into nothing